South Korean tech giant Samsung Electronics unveiled its first ever AI foldable smartphone series during its unpacked event held in Paris on Wednesday. There, the company also revealed several wearable products, including the Galaxy Ring and Galaxy Watch series. So for more on this, for our weekly focus this week, we have our business correspondent Park Konu joining us in the studio. Welcome, Konu. Thank you for having me. Lovely to have you. So, Konu, our first question for you is, why was the Galaxy Unpacked event held in Paris this time? So Samsung reportedly held the event in Paris, the venue for the Olympics, because of its sponsorship deal with the Games, as well as the global attention the event will receive. And as one of the official partners of the Olympics, Samsung plans to distribute exclusive Olympic editions of the new Galaxy Flip 6 to all 17,000 athletes participating. The athletes will be able to have those phones with them on the podium to take selfies. Previously, athletes having any personal belongings with them on the podium was banned, but Samsung made a special request to the International Olympic Committee. Well, it's really interesting to hear the reasons why the event held took place in Paris, but Kono, I think that what many of our viewers would want to know about is more on the latest Galaxy Z series. Of course, Eugene. So Samsung Electronics unpacked its slimmest and lightest foldable smartphone series, the Galaxy Z Flip 6 and Fold 6, with added AI features during the event. And because life-enhancing innovations should be open to all, we've been putting Galaxy AI into the hands of more people around the world. Galaxy AI will be available on 200 million Galaxy devices this year. AI functions are now available on Samsung's foldable series for the first time and are even stronger than those on the Galaxy 24 series, the company's first AI smartphone released at the beginning of this year. Samsung's foldable phones now provide real-time AI translation for 16 different languages during phone calls on third-party messaging apps, including KakaoTalk and WhatsApp, and even during everyday conversations. By utilizing the dual screens of the new foldable series, the latest on-device AI allows people speaking in different languages to communicate in real-time. The AI technology can even create more sophisticated artwork from simple sketches done on your phone. I really like it because there are so many useful AI functions such as photo editing. The previous editions were heavy, but the new ones are way lighter, so I like it. And I think another big question for consumers is how much will these new foldable phones cost? So please tell us about that and also about the other uh, wearable devices that were showcased at the event. So with stronger durability and a design that reduces creases on the screen when folded, Pricing for the Galaxy Z Flip 6 starts at 1,099 US dollars. The base model Fold 6 will cost 1,899 dollars. Also on Wednesday, the Seoul-based tech giant unveiled its Galaxy Ring. The lightweight Galaxy Ring, weighing around 3 grams, allows people to measure and record sleeping patterns, heart rate, and respiration rate. It can be worn daily for a full week on a single charge. The price starts from 399 dollars. Other products, including the latest series of the Galaxy Watch and Galaxy Buds, were also revealed at the event. The official release date for all of the products is July 24th. So with these latest line of products, especially the newest Galaxy Z series, could you tell us the business prospects of Samsung? So first of all, global technology market research firm CounterPoint predicts that sales for the new foldable phones will jump by around 30% compared to the previous models. While Chinese firm Huawei took top spot in the foldable phone market in the first quarter, experts say Samsung could overtake them. There were many people pointing out that the previous foldable series was less innovative, but this time they decreased the weight and upgraded the AI. Samsung will easily be able to reclaim its top spot. And Kono, Samsung Electronics has a lot of competitors in the field, so could you tell us more about the company's strategies going forward? Yes, Apple, for example, is planning to release its AI smartphone this September. One expert spoke about aspects Samsung should focus on to win the race. I can say Samsung is incomparable in terms of technology, but the point is how much the services in the devices can appeal to people, especially the younger generations. Improving technology is, of course, important, but to enhance competitiveness, 
It's crucial to know what experiences and what kind of impressions the users actually want. And other experts also point out the fact that foldable phones are quite expensive. So they say it'll be quite important to make those devices much cheaper. All right. Thank you so much for your report today, Kwanu. My pleasure.